With Google Maps Engine Lite, you can create powerful custom maps that allow you to draw, import, organize, and style your map any way you like. And you can also invite others to collaborate on your map with you. First, I'll need to go ahead and collect some data. So, by having a simple form that allows you to collect some data, such as location, name, food, and activity, you can click Submit and go ahead and collect some data. Here you see I've entered in my name, my favorite food, activity, and location. But it would take a long time to do this demonstration if I waited for everyone to fill in this form. So, I can do a magic autofill by having the same categories, start typing in a location such as Peru, Japan, and Germany, select all three, I hold the option key down, I select, and it creates lots of different locations for me. Next, I can add in some names, such as John, Mike, and Matt. So I'm going to autofill all of these. Let's try food. Let's try pizza, hamburger, and hot dog. We will magically autofill some more food. And lastly, let's do some activities like run, jump, and swim. We will magically autofill these. And now we have some data. So, what I can do is go to a brand new map and I can add a layer. By clicking add layer, it will ask me to import from specific places. Now I can either import from a CSV file or I can go ahead and simply import from my recent Google spreadsheet. So what I'm going to do is click magic autofill responses, click select, and now it's importing all of my data. Now, I want to add my place marks by location, name them by the names in my spreadsheet, and now it's going to populate all of the data that I just autofilled. For example, if I click on Spain, it says Kelly is from Spain and she likes to hike. I can also select different styles. So let's say I wanted a sequence of color and letters for all of my data points. I could choose that, now they each have a specific letter and they have a specific color. Now, if you're like me, I think that's worthy of a slam.